Okay, so I'm back. See, that was fast. Okay, I want to add on to um, the roller set video and tell you that the products I use, I, um, I co-washed with Herbal Essences Totally Twisted. I love this. This is probably my favorite. I did a co-wash, rinse, and then I did a deep condition. And it's the thing. I have been neglecting my hair as far as doing deep conditions. Like, I don't really do them all like that. And so, bad me. But I did make a vow that I was going to start doing them once a week. And so, hold on one second. All my products sit outside the bathroom door in a green container. So, that's why I keep bringing it out. Okay, so um, decided to purchase Jesse Curl Weekly Deep Conditioning Treatment. And I'll come back and um, talk about this on another video because this is really good stuff. Okay, so the purpose of this video is to talk about blended beauty. And I had been um, watching these products for about a year now. They're a little bit on the pricey side, which is probably why I didn't purchase um, but they seem to have really good stuff, and um, it seems like, you know, the way she has it set up on her website, you can choose products based upon your curl type. So, um, I bought the BB4 sample bag, and it came in this little bag, which is cute. I'm going to use this for jewelry or money or something. But anyway, or more products. <laughs> but, um, so I bought the BB4 sample pack, and I ordered this, I think I want to say either Thursday or Friday. It was here yesterday. I was like, man, she shipped fast. Like, she must have shipped it out the same day I ordered. So, in that pack, uh-oh, in that pack, you get um, soy cream shampoo. You get quenching conditioner. Butter Me Up, Silk Shake, Curl Fizz Pudding, Dang it. and Curl Styling Butter. Okay, and each, this little pack was $24, which I figured for all these, you know, it was a pretty decent price. And at least before I spend $19 on one product, I can at least test it out and see how I did on my hair. So, my first experience, I used it last night in the shower, and I washed my hair with the soy cream shampoo. I liked it. I thought it made my hair really soft. Like, my hair felt really good. Um, it lathered up pretty nicely, and I didn't need to use a lot. So, I still probably have, like, a, probably, like, this much. I don't have a lot of hair either. But anyway, try to show you the consistency. Oh. It's pretty thick. Okay. So, I used that. I only shampooed once. Um, and what I did like about it is that I could detangle with it and with my fingers. As far as the clean factor, I'm not sure what it would do for buildup because I didn't have a lot of buildup to begin with. So, I wasn't washing a lot out. Okay. So, that's the soy cream shampoo. Thumbs up. Then... I followed that up with the quenching conditioner. And let me just say, I really like this when I put it on. Like, I wish this was a leave-in. I'm almost tempted to leave it in my hair the next time I use it. So this is what it looks like. It's pretty thick. And um, not only is it thick, but again, I was able to detangle my hair just using my fingers, no comb. So it gave me... You know, a lot of slip. Not as much slip, let's say it's um, herbal instances, but enough slip that I could just use my fingers. Uh-oh, I'm making a mess. Use my fingers on it. Okay, so then I rinsed that out, got out the shower, I squeezed the excess water off my hair, and I followed that up with the Silk Shake. Now, I had a little card that gave you directions what you're supposed to do, and... Um, she'll give you directions on her website, but, um, I forget what this, this is supposed to be like a refresher, and actually on the website, it comes in like a spray bottle, 
So this is what it looks like. This is like the consistency. It's like really creamy. Um, so I rub that all through my hair. Oh, I'm just making a mess. And all through the ends. I don't want to waste any because I won't be ordering any products anytime soon. I'm going to wait. I said I wasn't going to buy anything else to after the first of the year. Get Christmas out the way. So um, I use this. Let's just rub some right there. Because you can use it on dry or wet hair. So I use it on um, wet hair. And I, you know, squeezed it through all over. Ran it through my fingers all over my hair. And then I followed that up with the curly fizz pudding. And it's almost kind of the same. It's not as, it's a little bit thicker. Yeah, this is much thicker, look. It's not budging. So this is what it looks like. Um, and this is supposed to be like, on her website it says for hold, for stronger hold, then you can use this. And this, the silk shakes, is like your leave-in. So I use that. Now, I didn't get like, oh, bouncy, bouncy spiral curls like I do with Kinky Curly. That's a little different. But I did get soft coils um, in which I can just pull back into a headband and just wear it like that for the day. Not have to do anything to it. It's moisturized. It's soft. You know, I didn't have to add anything else to my hair. So, so I would definitely order, okay, for sure I will order the soy cream shampoo and the quenching conditioner since I'm always looking for a shampoo that is natural. So I would order that, these two again. Um, silk shakes, I would definitely order the silk shake again. The curls fitting, fizz pudding, I'm not sure yet. Um, because, and the reason why I'm not sure is because I haven't tried the Curl Styling Butter or the Butter Me Up. So, ooh, ooh. Mm -mm. The Butter Me Up almost looks like Vaseline or grease. So, I imagine you'll probably use this on like Twist. Or maybe I'll try on roller set. So, I haven't tried that yet. Nor have I tried the curl styling butter. And this is like cake frosting. So when I try these two, but I need to figure out how to use them because I'm not really sure how to use these two. Well, I have an idea about the butter, but I'm not sure how to use this one. So when I figure that out, I'll come back and do another video. But um, so that's just a short, brief review on what I thought about those products. And let me see if there's anything else I want to say. Nope, this video is long enough. All right, girls, talk to you later. Bye.